Hi, this is Anand here. In today's video, we'll see how to create this beautiful button hover animation effect in Elementor. If you see over here, we have a button with an icon on the left side and a text on the right. But once we hover on it, the icon changes into an arrow. The icon background stretches over to the button. So we'll create, we'll learn how to create this beautiful hover effect in Elementor with just CSS. Excited to learn? Let's get right into it. So we are in the Elementor editor section. Let's create the structure first. Just for design, I will create a two column section. I'll simply add a text over here. Then a text editor. I'll simply copy the text. Just to add a bit more text. And then I will add a button. I will change the text to learn more. On the right hand side, I will add an image. Let's choose this image. And from the main container, Let's go to items, align it, align it to center. So our basic structure is ready. Now we need to add the CSS magic. For that, I will select this button. Make sure we will not add any icons from this section of the button. You can go to the style. If you want, you can remove the background color and for the text color we'll add this black color now let's go to the advanced scroll down to the custom CSS just for your information custom CSS is part of Elementor Pro and if you are interested in buying Elementor Pro you can check the link in the description below it's my affiliate link if you do consider buying through my affiliate link I will get a small commission at no extra cost to you that supports this channel and my website that being said let's add the CSS let's paste the CSS as you can see the icon and the icon background is already there and we have a bigger text if we hover over, the hover effect doesn't work. We'll add a bit more CSS for that. Let's click over here. We'll add this CSS. For your understanding, I've commented this section so you can understand this part is for the hover section, for the hover animation. Now if I hover over, see, the effect, hover effect is working. If you are finding this video helpful, Please hit the like button and share it with your friends. This helps the video reach to more people. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do consider subscribing. Now let me quickly explain the CSS. You can, as you can see, there is quite a bit of CSS. You don't need to understand everything. These are the main things you need to understand. From here, you can change the button color. Let's say if I change the button color to this. See the button color changes. See? If you change the arrow color, now once I hover, see the arrow color along with the text color on hover changes. So both are linked. Let's undo both. And the last one is for increasing the button size. It is set to 55. Let's say if I set to 65, see the button size is increasing. Now if I hover over, it is working perfectly. Just make sure you increase the button size to a decent level, not to an exponential level. Then that might break the design. Similarly, I can reduce the button size to, let's say 45. It is working perfectly as well. So I will set it to 55 again. 
let's say I've set it to 60. This looks good to me. Whenever we are changing the button size, the font size is also changing. But if you want to control this from the widget section, all you need is to scroll down over here, remove this font size. Then you can control that from the widget section. But to keep the design intact, I am controlling it from the CSS. Now let me briefly explain the CSS so you can understand how the CSS basically is working over here. We are targeting the Elementor button class from the element itself, setting position relative and then we are calculating the padding using the calc in CSS. Then we are setting a height of the Elementor button content wrapper. Then we are using the before pseudo element to create this circle. Again we are using the before and after pseudo element of this element a button text class to create this arrow icon and we are controlling the element text over here we are setting the font size according to the button size and the padding as well and on hover we are setting the width of this circle to 100 percent get this stretching effect and again we are targeting this before and after pseudo element to move this arrow on hover so this is basically is the css you don't need to understand everything just you need to focus on these things these three elements and that should work perf perfectly now let's check the responsive view it is working perfectly let's go to the mobile view it is working perfectly You can download the CSS from my website. The link is in the description below. Let's update the page. Before we preview it, let's change the text to see if it works or not. Let's add few dot to it. Let's see. It is working perfectly. So let's update. Let's preview the changes. It is working perfectly so this is how you can create this beautiful button hover animation effect in elementor with just css and finally if you need help with your elementor or wordpress project feel free to contact me through my website the link is in the description below i hope you have learned something new today if you like the video please do subscribe to the channel and hit the like button thanks for your time i'll see you in the next video till then bye bye take care